Surprisingly, North Florida has a lot of um, Civil War background, background into it. Um, the lowest, the furthest south battle um, ever fought in the Civil War was fought in one of my areas. It's a place called um, Olusti. Um, so that's kind of cool. Most people don't think of, you know, the Civil War being fought in Florida when, you know, it was. Um, there's, there was a lot of um, civil rights movement happening in Florida as well, especially on the Gulf Coast. You know, there's a, a place in one of my areas called uh, Roseville. They made a movie about it about 15, 20 years ago, and there's a lot of um, racism there, things like that. Um, so there's a lot of um, civil rights, a lot of U.S. history that happened in North Florida. I mean, it's, it's literally, you go there, it's a blast from the past. And there's, there's just so much history there. Um, and it's, it's pretty much the same as it was, you know, 200 years ago, because so much of parts of the mission are undeveloped. So you go out and you'll drive for, you know, 20 minutes, half hour through swampland that no one touched in years. Or um, you go and you meet with members of the church, especially, who have been there their entire lives, you know, the grandparents, the great grandparents, you know, everyone knows their family. And they've just been there forever, for as long as anyone can remember. They have, you know, great, great, whatever, grandfathers that fought in the Civil War and um, things like that. And um, there's lots of, you know, pirate pirate things in North Florida. And they used to come up the St. John's River and, and dump their, their ballast from when they were done from uh, voyages and things like that. And especially in Savannah, which unfortunately is not part of the, the mission, because Savannah is... A really, really old city. You know, I went to churches that George Washington attended church in, which was I thought was awesome. You know, it's just so much history there.